It doesn't draw the oohs and ahs of a crossover or the loud cheers of a dunk, and it's only worth a point. But we here at New Cap Sports are going to show some love to the most underrated part of basketball. I'm talking about the free throw, the unsung hero, the bachelor of hoops. Okay, maybe the last part went a little too far, but you do get the idea. So who better help to spread some love for the free throw than the Lakeland Rustlers men's basketball team? It's another daily shoot around practice for the Lakeland Rustlers and point guard PJ Gartner is working on his craft. Wait, free throws really count. Um, if you look at big games, if you look at when Kobe scored 81, a lot of his points came from the free throw line. So free throws really count, but nobody ever pays attention to it. How do you, PJ, change things up and get people to respect the free throw? Uh, all in the routine. Routine is big. Describe your routine for me then. Uh, my routine, I dribble it twice. I go behind my leg once. I think about it, and then I just let it go. Tree dribble, spin the ball in my right hand, take a deep breath, and shoot the ball. That's my routine. That's, why, that's how I do it. And while routines can help you concentrate, there has to be another way to get the charity stripe more attention. Do you have an idea or maybe something that could improve free throws, get the love that it deserves from fans, even from the ladies? Uh, <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> Do you think that a person on the basketball team can ever actually pick up a girl by saying what the percentage is coming to the free throw line? Will that ever happen in the future? Um, unless the girl knows basketball, I don't think she'll know what he's talking about. <laughs> like, yeah, I shot 100% from the free throw line. She's like, good, I guess. <laughs> so uh, maybe unless your free throw routine has a kiss or something, something like that. <laughs> oh, a little Romeo here, yeah, perfect timing yeah. for Valentine's Day. Maybe PJ is onto something. Maybe free throws have to be memorable and there's no other free throw memorable than Rick Berry's. I might switch it up a little bit, but that granny's pretty hard, I must say. Would you actually adopt the granny and use that in games? <laughs> I don't know. I don't think so. I don't think so. I don't know. Uh, if, it, if that helped, oh, why not? <laughs> Would you be able to give us a demonstration? I got you, yeah. Hey. Would you consider adopting it and trying it out for us and seeing if it works? I could try it out, for sure. I got too, too uncomfortable for me. <laughs> yeah, I got to stick with my routine, I guess. All right, we've gone through the experiment. I, I know it worked out for you more so than it did Rico. <laughs> would you adopt the Rick Berry routine of going underhand next time if it would help you get a few more points per game? I'm going to try it a few times. If I could go 10 for 10, then I'm definitely going to try that. <laughs> <laughs>